So we've all heard or perhaps seen archery before, but this coming weekend in Norwich is going to be an archery competition that the world has never seen before. So we've come down to Clickers Archery Store in Norwich to hear all about this event. I think it's a sport that a lot of people aspire to have and go at. It's a great sport because we have visually impaired archers, we have people shooting in wheelchairs, um, so it's a very accessible sport. It's an easy sport to begin with and the, the learning curve is actually quite quick. One of the problems for archery is that we're not particularly a spectator friendly sport and because we're the conventional target face, this is a, a 40 centimetre version, um, it's and this will be shot at 18 metres, so it's quite hard for an audience to see actually what's going on and what's you know and how the event's evolving. With the bite to hit miss system, effectively uh, we have a, a black foam target and then we have discs. And the idea for the archer is to knock the discs out of a hole. So for the audience, it's very easy to see if they've actually managed to do that. Right, so Kieran, you are the man who has kind of put the rule books together for, for next weekend's competition. How excited are you about it? Very. It'd be nice to finally get it uh, underway and uh, see how it works. Um, are you expecting kind of the archers to enjoy this significantly more than previous competitions? Absolutely. The, the rules that have been written are very strict in some aspects, um, but there are a few of them. So it, it makes it nice and simple, um, but if they do step over the line, it's going to be a slight issue for them. Now, what we've got here is a significantly reduced length of target. Yep. Um, you're going to give us a demonstration at hitting these targets, and okay. you're going to hit all three because you said you said this. Yep. Off, off it camera, will be yep. impossible to miss. It should be impossible. Do you to want miss, to yeah. give us a quick demonstration? Effectively, with the recurve archers, so the team is made up of two archers, a recurver and a compound archer, they're going to be shooting at a 60mm disc, which is quite a hard level for them to achieve. In a normal competition, if they get an arrow outside of a central zone, they still score points for it. With the biter hit miss competition, effectively, they either hit it or they miss it. So if they miss it, they get no points. Compound archers, and um, this is a, a fairly standard modern compound bow, um, the challenge is much greater. Effectively, what they're trying to do is actually hit a one penny piece at 18 metres to put it into context. Right, so Kieran, you said it was impossible <laughs> to miss the targets. Yep. Now, whilst most of them were pretty close, you managed to get one at the end. Yep. Um, what are you expecting me to be able to do here? Because I'm, I'm a complete amateur. Let's get somewhere near, shall we? Yes. Yeah. The Olympic Games were in London was great for the sport and it certainly raised the, the profile of the sport and it's really trying to build on that to just try and make it a bigger sport in the future. That's not bad. No, it's good. That's not bad. T Do I score any points? No. I don't. No, no points. To but my one. A very, very good effort. Very good effort. Thank you. No problem at all. Right then, so I don't think I'm quite ready for the biter hit miss competition this weekend, but that's not going to stop me from going home and practicing with my new rubber arrows.